Hi there, this is Kalyan Verma for SAP Crystal Reports and Dashboard Solutions on Facebook. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create blinking indicators in Excelsius. Sometimes the requirements demand that the user is focused to a particular area on the screen whenever they launch the dashboard. In such case, you can use various techniques like uh, contrasting colors or sometimes something moving like a blinking indicator. So let's see how we can create that in uh, Excelsius 2008. After the introduction of uh, color binding to your Excel, um, it's, it's become even easier to create such a kind of an animation in Excelsius. All we need to do is drag and drop a couple of components. In this case, I'm gonna drag and drop an Eclipse and also a Play Selector. So if you look at the properties of Eclipse, you can bind it, bind the fill this to, uh, uh, to a color. So in our case, I'm gonna do a gray and red. So simply type the colors. You can use uh, hexadecimal, you can use RGB colors, uh, you know, enclosed in, uh, in brackets separated by commas. There's, there's a variety of uh, formats that uh, Excelsius supports now for color, uh, color binding. So in our case, I'm just using gray for uh, inactive and red for active. So it's gonna blink red, gray, red, gray, and so on. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bind, uh, I'm gonna first configure my play selector. So if I look at the properties of play selector, I can do a data insertion. So in this case, I'm gonna do a row insertion. Select my source as both gray and red, and select the destination as cell P2. So just remember, cell P2 is the insertion for uh, for our play, play controller. Now let's uh, configure the behavior. I'm gonna do an auto play because I want the blinking to go on and on. And auto rewind and auto replay, just leave them checked. And I wanna play it for one second. So the entire sequence that is gray, red, plays for one second. So now we're done with the play controller. Now let's go to the Eclipse and we select the fill as solid. By default, the color is black. However, if you click on the palette options, you can see you can now bind the colors to your Excel sheet. This is a great feature uh, in the latest service pack. So I click on bind to a color and select my play selected insert cell, which is gonna be either gray or red. Uh, every second, it's gonna swap between gray and red. And that's all we need to do. Let's do a preview and see uh, what happens. There you go, gray, red. Every second it's gonna switch between gray and red and you have a blinking indicator for yourself. You can hide the play controller if you don't want to show it on the dashboard and simply make it look like a single blinking indicator on any corner of the dashboard where you want your user to focus initially. I hope uh, this was a useful uh, tip. Uh, thanks for watching.